How do you earn money online through storytelling? Three different ways I can share with you right now. The first thing is, if you're going to advertise, you know, one of the most effective ways through advertising is to actually tell a story. Oftentimes in advertising and different platforms, you might only have 60 seconds or two minutes to do the ad. It might be something like, hey, it's Ted McGrath, and I wanna share with you how I went from two clients a month to 20 clients a month to 2,000 new clients a month using video presentations that get clients consistently and how you know we build a business online that impacts people all over the globe. And you know when I first started out, I was in the insurance business at 21 years old, and I chased the money and I cracked six figures and then I OD'd from drugs and alcohol, almost died. And I woke up and realized, you know, that didn't do it money. So I chased the power. Five years later, I became one of the top partners for the top life insurance company in the country. And I was like, is this really all there is to my life? And then I realized I had a message inside of me. I had a story to tell. I had something to say bigger than just money. And I went out and I started telling my story, started sharing my message as a speaker, built a seven figure business and then started marketing the same story and message online. And now I'm also an actor and entertainer doing what I love. So click down below, you know, grab this free gift. That would be a story. See what I'm saying? So in an ad, notice how I got through that in like 60 seconds where I told them kind of the headline of, um, you know, here's the thing that I'm giving away, like this free gift, you know, on video presentations. And then I told them a story that backs up, you know, kind of the journey that I went on in 45 seconds. That, that same version of the story I could use in a sales video. So somebody's gonna come to a sales video and I'm gonna be pitching them on the product, but if I just tell them about the product and I go, hey, module one is this, module two is this, module three is this, without telling a story about my credibility, and storytelling, remember, has a pit moment where there's like a low, so I just kind of shared my low with you of ODing from drugs and alcohol, almost dying, and then it has a breakthrough moment of a high, which is kind of like a realization followed by results, so like mine was like, you know, what am I gonna do with my life? I wanna, I wanna do something where I have something to say, something that's meaningful. So I became a speaker and then I started getting online and then I became an actor. So, you know, you have this pit and you have this breakthrough in storytelling. So whether it's an ad that's a shorter version, right? Or it's a sales video that might be a longer version, it's two ways right there to use storytelling in an effective way that actually communicates and relates to money. If you're trying to sell something without telling your story, people don't know who you are. So storytelling creates the personal connection and trust factor. The third thing is, um, you know, if you're doing any type of service business where you want to give away consultations with people, free consultations, in videos like that, where you're going to talk about, hey, book a free consultation with me, I'm going to help you with X, Y, Z, storytelling of your customers is important. One of the ways a lot of personal brands get traction is when we start to hear the success stories of other people that are succeeding as a result of what you're teaching them with and what you're helping them with. So sharing client success stories is really powerful and really effective. Like, you know, I'm listening to Ted McGrath now, which is me. Yeah, okay, his story's kind of cool, but now I'm listening to some of his students and some of the people that he's helped and look at their successes. And I really relate with this guy over here, or I really relate with this woman, or I relate with this engineer. You know, earning money online from that perspective through storytelling, there's a way to do it where it's not just, hey, let me tell my story. Um, and a lot, you'll hear sometimes marketers go, oh, nobody wants to hear your story. Well, it depends the kind of brand that you want to build. I think people want to hear stories because people who have a heart and a soul and really care about it, people want to hear the stories of how other people succeeded and learn from their failures as well. So I um, hope this serves you guys. Um, you know, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, and uh, rock and roll, leave a comment down below. You guys are the best.